was a local artist. He was very prolific. He did a lot of carvings. A lot of people probably remember him from the old Patrons where he would go and carve uh, blocks of wood with a chainsaw. I believe this was opened in 1993. He moved to this area. I guess it's been open continuously until he started getting ill towards the end. The property went up on the market, so we made an offer on it and got it under contract. The family asked us to keep the name Elmore's Landing, so we promised we would and we would reopen it as an art gallery. We wanted to turn it into like a little art village, farmer's market. Music, things like that on the weekends, we really want to make it a community place so you can bring your children. It's a landmark, everybody remembers this place, everybody who stops by keeps saying, you know, they've been meaning to stop by here and they've been trying to catch it open, so we're excited. <laughs>